Purin Majid is available across the world on the App Store and has nearly 150,000 reviews. It is used by millions of Muslims. The BBC understands that the app was removed for hosting illegal religious texts. The Chinese government has not responded to the BBC's request for comment. The deletion of the app was first noticed by Apple Censorship, a website that monitors apps on Apple's App Store globally. In a statement from the app's maker, PDMS, the company said. According to Apple, our app Kuren Majid has been removed from the China App Store because it includes content that requires additional documentation from Chinese authorities. We are trying to get in touch with the Cyberspace Administration of China and relevant Chinese authorities to get this issue resolved. The company said it had close to 1 million users in China. The Chinese Communist Party officially recognizes Islam as a religion in the country. However, China has been accused of human rights violations and even genocide against a mostly Muslim Uyghur ethnic group in Xinjiang. However, it is not clear what rules the app has broken in China. Kuren Majid says it is trusted by over 35 million Muslims globally. Last month, both Apple and Google removed a tactical voting app devised by jailed Russian opposition leader Alexei Navalny. Russian authorities had threatened to fine the two companies if they refused to drop the app, which told users who could unseat ruling party candidates. Another popular religious app, Olive Tree's Bible app, was also taken down this week in China. The company told the BBC they had removed the app themselves.